bracket, we got K versus Almine. I don't, I don't, I need to go check the brackets again and see what's going on. <laughs> yeah. Palutena versus Chrome. We see this matchup like at least like three times today already. Yeah. Chrome and um, surprising a lot of Chroms here at Hat today. Yeah. Um, very exciting match we got here. So let's get straight to it. Palutena versus Chrome. Yeah, jump Steady has been super uh, consistent over the past couple months. It seems um, he's been here every week. He does very well usually. And then here we have K-Swiss right here. He's, he's a pretty up and rising. Had a really big comeback earlier on stream versus Fox. A really incredible second match. Yeah. And he's going again holding really steady right now. He's playing really solid. Yeah. So Sweet. far it looks like um, K can't really get a hit on Paolo, but here we go. There you go. He's got his first connection. So again, you know, Krom's doing a really good job saving his jump. Being really patient when he's getting comboed. Kind of taking it very well. He's spacing out really well. Very really nice. Um, what we're seeing right here a lot that's kind of helping him is that he's doing a lot of good yes. those, a lot of those good down tilts leading yep. straight into the forward tilts. Uh, then here we go, we're gonna start the combo, but doesn't quite connect that back air. There but that one will do. Nice fake up. Uh, yeah, trying to get that two frame with the down tilt. Probably really struggles to recover like around the edge. Yeah. Oh, 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 just a tip! Oh <laughs> my god, that you know that's pretty nasty. Yeah, that's pretty nasty. Love smash. That, that hitbox stays out really long. And there you go again. Um, a lot of Kroms, what they like to do is that whenever they get hit on shield, they usually resort to their up B to kind of punish it whenever they have a strong aerial. It's a really fast um, attack. Yeah. I think about like, it comes out at, like frame 10 um, after you get hit on shield, so it's really good. Um, unless Palutena hits uh, the shield at a very low place with like her fair, it's usually a really good way to kind of uh, punish it. So again, right there, he's doing it again. Whenever Palutena kind of does that back air against Krom's uh, shield, you can see him trying to go for it because again, enough enough frame to damage it, but he's a little late on the up B right there. Both of them playing very conservatively, it looks like, until they get a good opening like this. Kind of get those up combos again. Good juggle by Krom. Got a little greedy right there. Yeah. Alright. Palutena, probably going forward throw. Ooh, nice job. Yeah, just keeps with the lead traps. And we're going to see probably another counter. Oh, there you go. Yeah, there's nothing really Krom can do when he's on the ledge against someone like Palutena. Yeah, he had to, I think if he actually spaced it just a little bit better, you can kind of get like a small, um, against Palutena's edge guard in particular, if you get right underneath her toes, yeah. it causes her to fall on her feet with your up B, so it doesn't hurt you. Again, really good spacing coming out from Jump Steady. Yeah, every time Palutena does a spot dodge, it kind of like screws people up because she actually disappears, so you, you don't see where she's going. That's you go, that's the grab. Press it go Very again to get to the back air. Let's see if he gets the edge guard here. Jab, jab. Try to get the jab. Fast spacing. You can see, you can kind of see K Swiss. He's jumping a little bit more to kind of fake him out. He sees that jump say he's been reacting to a lot of his jump aerials. So yeah. he's been trying to see if he can get some of those um, tomahawks to jump straight into like a grab. Oh, very nice attempt at a combo. Both of them kind of dropping their combos there. Yeah. I love like those falling, uh, the, the falling up airs. Those work so well. Oh, Be a little oh. greedy right there. Yeah. I think that <laughs> I think it, Jump State is getting a little conditioned to his up B right now. So yeah. it's a little bad. Find out the best option. I think he should kind of space out to let his shield recover. Now like Jump Steady is holding back a little bit. Oh, there a nice go. read on the getting up back on stage. You can kind of see Jump State just re reacting very well. I know. He's like adapting to him really fast during the whole entire set. Kind of retaining his title as a number one seed. He's number one seed, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, but K-Swiss not one to be afraid. Doing a really good job holding his own. <laughs> yeah, definitely K-Swiss has the combos on lock. He's putting out a lot of damage. But if you can just, uh, I don't know, maybe read K-Swiss a little bit more. Or the other way around. Cases read jump stay a little bit more. I think that in the next set, what we're gonna have to see a little bit more is that um, jump stay is already kind of reacting a little more to his like aerial. So he's I think a little bit more down tilt, a little bit more staying grounded on the stage would probably help uh, Case was move a little more fluidly. And now I think like just kind of staying on the ground helps a lot with Palutena. So like you want to probably try to look for the punish whenever she's hitting on the ground, get a small down tilt during her jump animation on the aerials. So here we are, this is uh, what, Town of City. Town City. It's a good stage for Krom because the yeah. platform's always moving. Yeah, I can definitely oh. extend those combos. There you go. Good. Oh, there you go. Like he bounces off the platform. <coughs> right now he's just trying to put out those nears, trying to keep keep her out a little bit. 
good. Oh yeah, he, 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 he knew the re he knew he's gonna roll up. Yeah. Ooh, Again. Little, little, little counter there. Yeah, he's using those air dodges a lot more, uh, a lot better to conserve those jumps. Oh, but that's a little far yeah. away from the stage. A little big yeah, mistake by Casey. Unfortunate. So we're seeing a little bit. Uh, both players are kind of adapting to together right now. Um, <laughs> they're getting both a little bit yeah. scared to kind of like jump in a little bit more. And you see a lot more of these shields and people staying in place. So <laughs> yeah, like, both trying to get that parry going. Oh, I don't know what. So okay. K Switch tried to do a ledge trump right there, and that's what. That's kind of why he looked like he was falling down really fast for no reason. <laughs> but if he got the ledge trump, he probably could have turned to a backer. Really good. Yeah, so it's really hard to pull off though. So especially in a high pressure situation. Exactly. Yeah, they're both getting all these parries. I think uh, Case was reacting to his tilt a lot right now, so oh, he's adapting, kind of changing to kind of parry a little bit more, and then again, Case was to doing the same thing, kind of being wary about his aerials. And, and those jump settings kind of like falling with Case was every time he jumps to kind of anticipate, you know, when to put out like a, a forward air or something like that. So that's pretty good reading. Oh, oh there a little you go too early. Again. Let's see if you get it. Oh, oh. jump steady with the rock steady. <laughs> hands, <laughs> moving like a robot. That discipline, you know, that's that's something you're gonna get with hours of practice. Exactly. <laughs> Seems like these these players know, uh, they they know what to do. Again, see jump steady, kind of big. So, oh, good oh, yeah. reaction tech chase again. Problem jumping out of the way there. And yeah, kind of poking out there with those down sets. Yeah, looks like he's uh, case was getting a little bit more momentum. He still has to bring a stock back, and he's already at 64% and now 72. And if someone can do it, I definitely believe in case was being able to do a comeback. Had a great comeback earlier against um, that Fox earlier. So yeah. really, I I believe in his ability. Oh, oh very yeah, good. he knew. Oh, oh that's perfect. Oh, oh, that was that was a good play. By very case good, knowing his timing on the stage. Great stage awareness too. Even a high pressure situation, he knew. So he's Maybe that was luck. I don't know. Oh, very I, I nice. want to put it past case Swiss. Yeah, these platforms are actually really helpful for Chrome on Town City. It's actually, I can see why a lot of Chrome players seem to favor this stage as like a counter pick. Yeah. So again, paying for yourself. Let's we'll see if we can get the edge guard oh, right yeah. here. You know, he's, he's in a very good position right now. So I think these guys are about even right now, considering Chrome's uh, damage output. Oh, there oh, you go. Getting that. Looks like Jump City can't really get in oh. on okay, K-Swizz right now. Now they're dead even. Let's see if you get the comeback. Jab, jab. Oh, wow. that's it. I was surprised, I was surprised <laughs> he didn't grab uh, if he came with the neutral getup. Yeah, Palutena when she's on the edge, it's really, that's the thing about like, this matchup. Like, yeah. Krom, usually they try to just spam their um, jabs against them, but yeah. sometimes Palutena, if she gets that back throw at the end of the stage,